to Bournemouth. Today, I would like to invite you to the biggest open-air event in this leading British resort, which is expected to boost the region's budget by 30 million pounds. Air Festival 2024. In addition to the spectacular aerial acrobatics, I'd like to show you some of the attractions that accompany this event and invite you to join me for a leisurely walk through the most picturesque spots in this vibrant tourist city. Together, we'll explore the charm of Bournemouth, uncovering hidden gems and enjoying all this coastal paradise has to offer. Pier Approach in Bournemouth is a recently revitalized area that serves as a gateway to the town's iconic pier, featuring creative seating areas and informative panels that highlight the history and culture of the region. The area also includes the Bournemouth Wheel, a large observation wheel offering stunning panoramic views of the coastline, making it a must-visit attraction for tourists.
In addition to the breathtaking aerial displays, Bournemouth Air Festival offers a variety of attractions on the beach, including a fun fair with rides, numerous food and drink stalls, and military displays where visitors can interact with the armed forces. There are also boutique stands selling souvenirs and small items, making it a vibrant event for all ages. Coming in right, long for Lewis Cody. Lots of red on the side of our house, going to the Michael Hall, Adam Bowen. As the last level now, we're going to step up to the band at that point. What's the most important part of our strong riders? Nice round of applause as the last man starts to come to the ground, nice and safely. Now, it's time for an energetic stroll through the lively funfair where the sounds of rides and laughter fill the air and past charming shops offering unique souvenirs. Our walk will lead us to the bustling pier area, especially vibrant this evening, with a variety of attractions to explore not just culinary delights, but entertainment that promises an exciting night ahead. <laughs>
Ahead of us is another exciting day at the Bournemouth Air Festival. This time, I invite you to join me for a selection of the most thrilling displays in the early afternoon session of these extraordinary aerial acrobatics. Get ready to witness some of the finest pilots showcase their skills in the skies. The Bournemouth Air Festival began in 2008 as a project to revitalize the town's tourism. It quickly grew into one of Europe's top air shows, attracting hundreds of thousands of visitors annually. Initially focused on aerial displays, the festival has expanded to include a wide range of attractions for both aviation enthusiasts and general visitors. Bournemouth Square is the lively heart of the town, where street performers, local markets, and seasonal events entertain both locals and tourists. 
surrounded by historic buildings and modern shops. It's a popular spot for shopping and dining. Its proximity to the lower gardens offers a seamless transition from the bustling town center to a peaceful green space. Lower gardens in Bournemouth have a rich history, dating back to the late 19th century when they were designed as a Victorian pleasure garden. The gardens are known for their exotic plants and trees, which have been a highlight since their inception. This historical significance makes the gardens a cherished spot for both locals and tourists. That's almost everything for today. I'd like to encourage those who haven't yet subscribed to my channel to do so, so you don't miss any new videos. 
Finally, I invite you to check out the photos I took during the festival. See you soon.